Has anyone not Sorry. read it? So these are just little notes. We have Sarah James here from New Zealand. Uh, my name's Scott. And, uh, Scott here from London. That's right. So uh, thank you to our 21 new blues dancers. So it was a very hey. introduction course, but you guys were amazing today. We did three sessions. The first session was really about movement. So we started separated, and we did this thing of actually seeing if we could get our body to create a nice message in terms of angles and so forth. We went side and front, a summary. Then we did it this way, and we did a grapevine, if you remember. We asked our partners to step forward and back, move like that. Then we made it a bit harder, and we did the same thing like that, then the same thing like that. So the first session was really just about blues movement. Then we did a nice exercise. We'll do it this way for you, Paris. Where we went, walk, walk, hold, over and catch. Okay. Then we did a little dip. Walk, walk. You can see I put my foot and my hip up close to Sarah. The first one was just straight down. Right. The second one had a little flick and down. Do you want to say anything about yeah. that? Just keeping your leg really relaxed in that is what causes him to be able to flick the leg up. Okay, and then uh, so we worked on that and we did a little bit of walking up the room and so forth, so just to make sure we're clear and we had good clarity. Then we did a little triple step, but not a triple step movement, where we went da, ba, boom, and boom, ba, ba. Yeah, so Sarah did some exercises with you. Do you want to talk about that? Yeah, so what we got to do is putting all our weight on one leg, doing a bit of a half circle, and then changing the weight, and then placing the foot. That allows us to stop here for other movements, like the next thing that we taught. We did that going both ways. So then when we did some of that, we added that little flick, and so we went boom, ba, boom, and boom, ba, ha. So you see my hand here, moving uh, Sarah's closest hip through, and creating that nice block. So that took a bit of time, but that was a lot of fun. That was the harder part. Then we did the silly class. The silly class. Yeah. This one. Yeah. I call it a silly class. All right. OK, so then we did a little dummy. Boom. All right, we worked on movement and stretch. We tried not to be obvious. We tried to go to quick, quick, slow, and just change it up a bit. And then we ended up doing the same direction as well. Okay? Then leaders, we did a forward replace up. Hip circle? Hip circle or whatever is comfortable for you. Okay, all right, just taking a leany hop move or a rock and roll move, a six speed underarm turn into something that's Belongs on the blues dance floor. Leaders, then we did a nice big circle with our forward in place. Forward and round. Boom. All right. Then we talked about the leaders being creative. We did all sorts of things. We did lowering the shoulder to make some nice contrast. Eventually, with our foot on our right, we put our left hand, asked our partner for a pass to catch, as if we were saying good day, but like this, okay? Ask our partner for a pass, end up back in here. We also did lunges, by the way, early on. Mm -hmm. Hopefully that's a pretty good wrap. Yeah. Hopefully that was.